Hello everybody, this is Chris the Master Warrior, and welcome back to Let's Play Danganronpa. In the last episode, we found a lot of interesting facts coming from Byakuya himself, and, you know, <laughs> more suspicion around amongst the crowd. In this episode, we're going to have our second, I guess, free time. And here I have with me... Uh, He's going first. <laughs> I guess you go first. <laughs> Hey, oh, hello everybody, this is BeastCat100, I'm kinda just popping in for a couple episodes here. And I'm Waterbuff, coming back at you to voice some of the female parts, except for quote-unquote best girl, because <laughs> Chris wanted to take her back, because he didn't tell me I how did. to do the voices <laughs> properly. It was my fault, and I acknowledged that it was my fault. I know, but I'm just busting your balls. D don't do that, it's painful. Any but so um so we gotta figure out we gotta find someone to have a hangout day with. I wonder who you I wonder who we wanna hang out with today, and I wonder if anyone else is actually on the second floor. Gee, I know who you wanna hang out with. I mean I already hung out with her. But I could hang out with her again. That is a possibility. Um but I kinda wanna hang out with Toko. I wanna, wanna hang out with Toko. Yeah, because I want to get her. I want to get her to not be judgmental, but judgmental. But let's talk to Celeste first, because she's just Did here. You need something? <laughs> well, if it is the D rank Makoto, <laughs> is something the matter? <laughs> okay, that's a great start. Hmm, should I hang out with Celeste? Nah, not yet. Anyway. Well, fine. Fuck you too. <laughs> <laughs> Oh uh, yeah, there's a ro there's a moment coming later, Rob, that you'll see where she shows off her. Eh, side. My eh, side? <laughs> yeah, like her creepier side. Oh, I thought you meant me. I'm like, oh, I didn't do anything. Because you speak like that normally. <laughs> uh, I wonder, actually, I wonder where Taka is. <laughs> we need to talk to Super Saiyan, because he seems to be a little bit sad in the oh, last one. Oh, you can go the second floor now. Oh, oh yeah. god, it's Hamster Man. Eh, it's Hifumi. Eh, hey, there's... Oh, I want to speak to her though. Chihiro. Let's let's see where who else ever, where where everyone else is. I think Sakura could be in here. I wasn't wrong, and there's Mondo. <laughs> Should I hang out with Mondo? Because I want to hang. I, mm. I think Toko might be in the library. It makes sense. She's the writing prodigy after all. Yeah. I don't want to talk to you. Because <laughs> he Fumi is. Uh, if Fum is a pervert and he knows it. Yeah. And if you don't write fan fiction or anything along that line, you're an uncultured swine. Oh. And God. let's oh, leave oh, immediately. Oh. <laughs> the asshole. Oh, okay. Hey. hey. <laughs> Oops. Oh. oh. Hmm. I can't concentrate through that. Kind of deep. I was about to leave though. Apparently you can't go through but the you're door walking right now. Past him, so he doesn't like that. Oh, so I guess I have to talk to him? No. no. Boo. He seems really focused on that book. That's not the really good time to talk to him. Then how do I leave? You go out the way you came. Oh, right. <laughs> Dumbass. Shut up. Make me. I forgot. I forgot that there was a button I could just leave from. Uh, what's over here? You mean like how you almost got trapped in the uh, in the slot machine? Yeah. <laughs> we don't need to. We don't need to talk about that. <laughs> that Actually, I do because I have very limited information to go off of. So. Hey, there's Taka. Hmm. I don't see Chihiro. I mean, Jesus. Okay. I don't see Toko, so I'm gonna talk to Chihiro and, you know. Yeah, yeah. I mean, I, I'm, assuming I'm assuming that not all the characters can be accessed Aww. every time. I would assume so. Um. Uh, oh, Makoto. I didn't realize you were there. Should I try to cheer her up? Yeah! You Let's are... try to cheer you up! Yeah, I could use a little change of scenery. Um. Do you mind keeping me company for a while? Sure! I don't know if I have any presents for you though. <laughs> Spent a nice relaxing time with your hero. And I grew a little closer with her that day. Oh, she's so cute! She's so yes. precious. She is cute. So what present can I give her? Your love. <laughs> oh, 
I can give her sea salt. <laughs> no, I don't want to actually give it to her. <laughs> no, I didn't mean to. Oh no. Huh? You're giving this to me? I pressed the wrong button. I wanted to look at it. I'm sorry. You don't have to make a big fuss over me. Aww. So does she like it or not? I, I, I yeah, I don't know. And I guess that was that free time. Still plenty of time left. Oh, so I guess we can talk to other people. Or maybe there's like a certain amount of people that are available now, because I didn't see Chihiro either. Blech. Jesus Christ! You just want to call everyone Chihiro. Yeah, I, everyone's Chihiro now. E everybody's Chihiro. Oh, uh, hi, Celeste. <laughs> What's the line from The Shining? Because that's what that reminded me of. <laughs> I have grown entirely accustomed to life here. With enough time, any place can eventually come to feel like home. Hmm. You know... I'm a fucking cunt. You know... <laughs> you know, let's spend some time with her, because I don't want to get on her bad side at all. As for me... I truly frighten myself to captivate even insignificant little creatures like yourself. And yeah, and spend some more time with Celeste. I would've given you the sea salt, to be fair. Ha! So what else do I have? I know I have other stuff Don't that I got. Don't click on anything. Yeah, no. Actually, how many do I even have? None. Yeah, none. So I can check it now, because I have to press left click and not right click. Basic seasoning produced in the evaporation of seawater. It's also used as a preservative. Uh, no. No. Okay, let's escape. I now know this. I could have told you that. I was so much. Love status ring. No. no. I'm not giving that to you. Oh, I, I have to go at this speed, too. Because my computer is the greatest thing of all time. Uh, I know there's other presents that I have. Like the ray gun Zurian. What does this do? Creative high tech feature. Actually, Chihiro would have probably liked that. A single shot can melt every molecule in a fully grown human. There aren't any batteries, though. <laughs> so you can't fire it. Aww. Chihiro might have liked that, though. Golden gun. What's this? Or maybe that, that. Is that a reference to, to Goldeneye? I don't think so. It doesn't look like a Goldeneye gun. It's referred by a famous assassin. It's not really much good by itself. You can't even cock it. <laughs> cock. Okay, let, let me <laughs> penis see what, what happened. I got nothing. I got, I got no got audio at all. Ooh, give her the past, crystal like, skull! Like, oh, you had no audio? Yeah. yeah. Everything oh, that's awesome! Time. Um... No, not Mr. Fastball. Give her the fucking crystal skull. Oh, yeah, I already gave it to Hina. <laughs> <laughs> Rob saw that episode, and I gave the golden airplane to... I gave it to Hina because I didn't know what else to give her, because I didn't have anything else, and she didn't like it. Although I could have give this, given this to uh, recently deceased Leon, but nope. That episode that broke my heart. Yeah, it, it definitely tugged in my heartstrings a bit, too. Because I, I really like... Ginger? Like <laughs> what was that, Rob? I... I, I know. <laughs> I mean, it's fine. Uh... Oh, fashion. I would Oh, she's also dead. Yeah. <laughs> Were you talking about Sayaka? I was talking about Sayaka, but for the fashion stuff, I was more talking about Junko. <laughs> yeah. The spare bat. Also, what's his face would love that. School crest. I can't get rid of that. I tried to. That's a key item. Hmm. Uh. Yeah, I'm gonna give her the despair bat. I can't give her the crystal skull, no matter how much I want to do that. I'd have to go back to the to the to the slots mm -hmm. and give the gambler a prize from there. Oh wait, yeah, oh, that's a key, key item too. too. Oh good. Oh, Just is it read the description? <laughs> yeah. Is it from the uh, each it's character? From, from, it's from beating chapter one. Okay. Well, I had three tendrils, so I can give you one of those. <laughs> I just gotta go all the way down. Why would you give her a chin drill? I don't know. Would I give her the ray gun, which I would rather or give to Chihiro? Or the golden gun. Hmm. Okay, I gotta look that up. 
Okay. This is fine. Oh, how wonderful. You can throw it in the trash on the way... <laughs> yeah, guess who didn't like it? On your way out. <laughs> I don't think she was too happy with that. <laughs> Makoto, I would like to share something with you. What is it? You're not the speaking voice anymore. Shut the fuck up. I wasn't trying to do the speaking voice. I just kind of predicted that line. Just go. Okay, Rob. <laughs> My perfect gambling strategy. Oh, good. Is it really such a thing? Indeed. Of course there is. Are you ready? Please pay attention. We are in class, after all. Whatever the game, you must have a mind for strategy. This will allow you to increase your odds of winning. However, the exciting part about gambling is that there is a power which can overwhelm any strategy. There is. Indeed. That power is <laughs> luck. <laughs> Hell no. Of course it is. Go fuck yourself. Rob? Oh, sorry. sorry. Luck. luck. <laughs> Actually. Wow. wow. Thanks. Thanks for bringing my attention there to that There are only forward. two types of... Blah, 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 blah. Can't speak today. There are only two types of luck. Good and bad. There is no in-between. This is true. And that luck is built into every human at the moment of conception. Like a computer program. Is that okay? Some call it fate. The bottom line is, luck is life. Then why is the ultimate lucky student here at this school where you have to fend for your life? Do you see what I am saying? Maybe she wants to test her luck. Anyway. Do you mean that's your perfect strategy? <laughs> Correct! You see, I was programmed to have good luck when it comes to gambling. This is why I have never lost. So that's well, all that's there all is there to is it. To it. <laughs> you are the ultimate lucky suit, yes? Does this perhaps exceed my own luck? One day I hope to put that to the test. I hope you are well. <laughs> well then, have a nice day. Without another word, she quietly disappeared. I'd say that my life's been more bad luck than good luck lately. Gambling's probably not a good idea for me. <laughs> and hey, now that's we exactly have me. Exactly me. <laughs> <laughs> and now we have more information for for the report card. And now we have more skill points. We're gonna get more story. After parting ways with Celeste, I went back to my room. I have a feeling Monokuma's gonna. Earn yeah, there it is. It's nighttime. Nighttime. Daytime! Uh, what's Mr. Bear got to say before the day's over? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we already know. It's nighttime. <laughs> Another day gone. But even though today's over, this game definitely isn't. How long is this gonna keep going? I know that's not a fourth wall break, but I think that's kind of clever nonetheless. Yeah. All the stress and anxiety kept me from falling asleep until late in the night. Oh boy! <laughs> Whenever I spot a cute girl, I have a tendency to stare! That's creepy. I can't help it, I just gaze with intensity! The other day I rode my bike to the train station! I was in the bathroom, just looking at myself in the mirror! Okay. <laughs> what? What? Monokuma spoke. Uh, That's usually when I go silent. He he said that he would look in the fucking. Oh wait, I just got what he said. Okay. <laughs> got it. So is he called his good? No, I think he's just a narcissist. <laughs> yeah, we get it, Monokuma. Monokuma. Guess I better. Huh? Monokuma is PJ confirmed. Duh. <laughs> yes. I mean, half of Monokuma is PJ. Yes. The yes, evil I half. Know. Also, I have to go to the dining hall. So I guess story. I mean, it's oh good because we only gosh. we only spent 15 minutes doing nothing. Story time. Story time. Story time. And I and, and I, I got, got maybe, maybe five, five of those five minutes, minutes with the audio. <laughs> oh, it's awesome. Well, you can watch this episode later. This is true. You know, you know uh, in uh, like two in months. Like two months. Probably in a few weeks, I don't know. I went to a breakfast meeting, same as always, but 
Uh oh. Wait. Is there another murder? <laughs> I wanted to do roll call. Is, is this everyone? It feels a little small. Byakuya and Toko had stormed off yesterday, and it wasn't too surprising they hadn't come today. Even, even the table table looks bigger somehow. <sighs> I assume that is because three people are dead and two are abstaining. <sighs> yeah, with yeah, five people missing, I guess it would feel kind of empty. Hmm. Still, I know Byakuya is whatever, but we shouldn't shouldn't we go check out on Toko? Serious. Yeah. Already fucking the lineup. <laughs> I vote no. She's super annoying. <laughs> it's pretty good, Rob. How can you be so cold? You are like a piece of rock candy. You hear me? <laughs> that's, that's, that's coming from you. Yeah. What? No, rock candy isn't cold. It's sweet. Dude, shit. Anyway, Bianchi is the real problem. If we don't keep an eye on him, he might really kill someone. You can see it in his eyes. We got no choice. Get some rope. We're gonna have to keep him bound and gagged. That's going a little overboard. <laughs> Don't you think? <laughs> He's right! In this situation, there's nothing scarier than when an ally turns loose cannon! Oh good, mom mentality. mentality. <laughs> it's just like when we were kids and someone would go crazy at sports day or whatever! What? What the fuck are you talking about? You're gonna use- you're gonna use the rope to do some tug of war or something? Idiot! I'm not an idiot! <laughs> you're an idiot! <laughs> Who you calling? Okay, who you calling stupid? I love how you're going back and forth with yourself. Yeah. Huh? What's wrong with you? Here? You don't look so great. Oh. Oh, I'm just going through a little self-loathing. I know how that's like. Huh? Self? Self? Well, after what Fiakia said to me yesterday, I just got so nervous. I locked up. I couldn't say anything. Oh yeah, Rob. Uh, fucking Byakuya just shot her down, and I was so pissed off at him when he did that. Londo ended up having to help me out, and even he said I was someone who can't fight back. Oh, that's true. Oh, that is true. He did say oh. that. I I hate how weak I am. Oh. I see. So Mondo made you depressed. Why? What? How is it my fault? Hey, come on. I wasn't trying to be mean. Besides, girls are just natural. <laughs> wow. Oh, no, you just opened a can of worms. I'm sorry, I don't, sorry, know, I don't when know when to, when react, to react, react because I can't, I can't hear you. Sorry. <laughs> are you crying? It's because you were screaming like a lunatic. <laughs> Hey, come on. Hey, come on, don't cry. It's my fault, okay? I won't yell at you anymore. Really? I'm not sure I can believe that. Huh? Just shut up! What? I got it. What? I'll make you a promise as a man. Huh? Promise? As a man? Yeah, that's right. Maybe I mentioned this before, but... Oh, yeah, he did. He did, actually. Ever since I was a kid, there was one thing my brother told me over and over again. He said no matter what happens, a real man always keeps his promises. That's what he left me. Uh, left you? Oh yeah, my brother's dead. Oh, um... Yes, that's, that's right. true. Anyway, I don't want to talk about it. Don't want to make you all guys, all you guys cry. No. Anyway, so you can trust me when I make that promise, so you don't gotta cry anymore. Uh, okay, thank you. Thank you, Mondo. Aw. Sure. I swear I'm a cord shade head. <laughs> that is my official name, damn it. But I still don't like how I am right now. I have to get stronger. If I'm so weak, anything can make me cry. That's not good. Still, don't stress out too much about having to get stronger. Um, no, I want to get stronger. Maybe I should start working out. Hmm. Interesting. <laughs> in that case, I would be happy to help you out. Yeah, I had a feeling soccer would chime in. <laughs> but then, Miss Fujisaki would get smashed into a million pieces! Just a second. Shut up, you! 
<laughs> you know? Oh, finally, oh, finally cracked, cracked a smile, smile huh? huh? I see. Y yeah, thank, thank you. you. Everyone, thank you. Looks like your hero's gotten some life back. I fucking want to just cuddle with her. She's so fucking cute. Anyway, yeah, man, if we keep helping each other like this, we're bound to get into this crappy place sooner or later. And this is when Byakuya comes in and is like, I don't care. I mean, someday, I'm sure. I mean, I'm sure Monokuma would love to interrupt that. Still, our biggest concern right now is the other two who never showed up to breakfast. What I can do to try and understand... What can I do to try to understand those two better? More free time! More free well, I, mean, I just want someone to die already. Is that horrible? I mean, it's gonna happen eventually. Actually, we could literally skip free time. They no, did the no, game. No, no, the no, game no, did no, say no, that it's a possibility, no, but I would rather want to talk to Eric when and get skill points and all that. Plus, we get to learn more about them. Oh yeah, this opened up by the way, Rob. I haven't gone in here yet, so. And I, I and I quoted I quoted this in the episode because I know I I'm not saying I want this to happen, but I know it's going to happen where there's going to be a bath scene. Because it's going to be an anime like bath scene as there always is, and I haven't actually looked at this room. I could do that. Lockers. One of them is unlocked, but I don't see anything inside. There's so thinking of that one place that we talked about before that we couldn't figure out which game it was in. Yeah. Oh. Actually, I'm gonna do. Actually, help. Hold on, I'm gonna do a quick cut. Bob, that doesn't, that doesn't really help. help. <laughs> I can't hear you. Did we squat? I just want to make sure I heard you. Okay, um, so, wait, what'd you say, Kaylin? Check out the chairs. Oh, yeah, I was gonna do that. Um, there's a massage chair. Maybe we'll use it once and get really tired. That looks like a, you think, you say that looks like a little bit like a face? It looks like a side face in the, Ooh, in the chair. Now that you mentioned something, it does. Oh, oh. Oh, yeah, I also got a crap ton of Monokuma coins after beating the trial. <gasps> you know what that means? Just go right directly downstairs. <laughs> All right, let's actually go here because I want to see if we can find anyone else. Byakuya and Toko probably are still in. No, Toko's probably still in her room. Then, if that's the case. It's a good thing your viewers can't see me making all the faces at you. Yeah, no, because visual humor is great. Let's do some gambling! I, I need to get more presents, so... It only makes sense, right? I did this mid-episode before. Plus, I I actually remembered how to freaking <laughs> enter more coins in. That looks like food. More food, so I'm probably gonna give that to fucking Hifumi. Of all the people. What was that, Rob? What was that, Rob? I said, just put them all in at once. <laughs> You'll be sure to get a repeat. <laughs> Someday. That's the end of the game. It's like the final time. <laughs> of course. Imagine that happening now. Ah, oh, bloomers! I'm waiting for one specific item. Rob, I, I think you know what I'm talking about. Maybe. <laughs> I'm waiting for... Uh, that looks like a lunchbox of some sort. Put two in and see what we can get. That's a book! That'll be good for... Toko. Yeah. Either Toko or Hifumi, because technically he's, he's a fanfictionist, so it could kind of work for him. And but I think she would enjoy it more. I think he would enjoy the food more. Is it kind of hilarious that she also likes romance novels? Like a certain other person we know. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. I think that's enough gambling for a bit. Lucky. Oh, Lucky! Oh, I got something else! Ooh. Hey, this is a thing I can give to Celeste. Bless you and your lovely face! Anyway. 
Anyway, uh, let's talk to some more people. So this will probably just be a free time day, and then next time we'll get into the uh, to the story. It's the best time to to record, especially best like. Best time to wear a striped sweater is all the time. I'm singing it off key. I'm, I'm, I should feel ashamed. I'm, I'm singing that way off key. Um, should we talk to Soccer or to, uh, Mondo? Because I kind of want to speak to him. I feel I feel like he has a soft side to him. And we'll find Jesus Toko after. Christ. Uh, so bored. Bored, 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 bored! <laughs> yeah, let's hang out with you. Hell yeah! I'm totally down to kill some time with you! Literally or figuratively? Uh, both. Yes. What would you like? Out of all the new things that I got, what would you like? Royal curry. No. Curry pack made for kids. Yep, definitely, um, <laughs> Fumi. Made with expensive, high-quality ingredients you wouldn't expect from kids' food. Okay. Rat. Oh, right. I can press left and right. <laughs> Just skip. A set of canned and vacuum-sealed foodstuffs. The taste isn't bad, and certain snakes that enjoy hide-and-go-seek are just crazy about it. <laughs> Flotation donut. A gigantic donut that doubles as a flotation device, and naturally you can snack on it while floating out to sea. It comes in a variety of styles. I'm not giving you the love stick. The God of War charm. You'd probably like this. A charm devised by the protective deity of martial arts. Actually, no. Sakura would probably like that. that. Sakura would like that more. Um, Tornico's pants. Celeste oh, oh. is getting this. Oh, yes. <laughs> Because she's definitely the gothic Lolita. Mm-hmm. Wonder Dungeon. Alright, so then you probably would like the golden gun. But you don't have it anymore. Yeah, I don't. Can't imagine why. Let's give you the fastball. Hell yeah. Oh, you like this. Ah, can I have this? Thanks, man. Yeah, I think he liked it. Yo. Hey, Makoto, what's your ride? Oh, sorry. Huh? huh? Uh, ride? ride. <laughs> Why? Yeah, man, your hog, your chopper, your motorcycle. Alright, I, I don't ride anything. Huh? What? You're not a little kid anymore, right? And you still don't have a hog? Jesus Christ. God, you're such a fucking dweeb. Uh, sorry? Yo. Yo. Alright, man, I'm gonna educate you. A real man rides Kawasaki, okay? That's what I ride. Hell yeah. You ought to see it. You ought to see it, man. The V-Twins like the The V-Twins got that monster power. It's like you're dancing. Of course, it ain't for just anyone. You got to have the skill to handle it. You got to really love your... Yeah. <laughs> you must really love your motorcycle. Stop fucking around. Hell yeah, I do. I'm a goddamn biker, aren't I? We're as crazy as hell. Yeah, you're yeah, the leader you're of the, the leader biggest biker, biker gang in Japan, Japan, right? This is true. Hell yeah. Damn straight. The Invincible Crazy Diamond Gang. Apparently not that not invincible. <laughs> you want to come on a ride with us? The monster sounds coming out of that straight pipe hot. Damn. Straight pipe? Why? Come on, you got to know what a straight pipe is, right? It's like, I'm, it's like when something's missing, right? That's why it makes a monster sound. I'm going to take a wild guess and say... Yeah. Yeah, when well, the motorcycle doesn't have a muffler, right? Hell yeah. Hey, hey hi. hi. I realized that that wasn't blue after I'd read it. I apologize. I because I can't hear you nonetheless. Oh, good. So you did know. I was like, so you did know. Good. Then that's that. Next time we ride, you're riding with us. That's true. Man, it makes me think back to when I first started riding. Yo. Yo. My big bro used to ride too, you know? His name's Dot Daya. I think that's a pun. Daya and Mondo. Together we were diamond. <sighs> you got it now? <laughs> I got it right away. Together we were the Diamond Brothers. Everyone up and down the country knew us. Why? Of course, I was always the cool one. <laughs> Diamond Brothers? That sounds kind of incredible. By the way. First time I went out, I ended up at the back of the pack. Eventually, the cops got on us and they surrounded me. I was in some tough shit, man. Hey, damn it. 
So I pulled over when they came up to me. Well, let's just say it was a massacre. A massacre? Man, Mario, you must really be strong. Stop fucking around! Of course! You can't wave the banner for our gang without some that kind of strength. Dude, that shit. In a fight, they'll go for the leader first. Kill the leader of the pack, you know? That's why the other gangs come after me. So if you want to be the leader of the pack, you gotta be a tough motherfucker. Yo. You'll see what I mean when we go on our first ride. Get ready for it. Actually, maybe it's better if I didn't, don't get involved in that sort of thing. And like I said, I don't have a motorcycle. I don't even, I don't even know how to drive one. Hell yeah. Then you can ride with me. Oh. Riding with Mondo, but other targets, other gangs target him first, right? Other targets gang him, so. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> no, no, no way. Hell yeah. Shut up, Caitlin. <laughs> Here, I didn't say anything. You didn't, I could see you nodding from the corner. No, I was bouncing. Oh, sure. I was like, <laughs> <laughs> hey, I said get ready for it. Damn, I am pumped. Can't wait to get out of here now. We're no left. Mondo left, apparently in a pretty good mood. Crap, crap, this is really bad. Even if I get out of here, I still might be in real trouble. Hey, at least we got some more experience with Mondo. That's a good thing. It doesn't matter. <laughs> Dragging my anxiety behind me, I went back to my room. And is it still daytime? It's not telling me, so I probably, yeah. Let us explore some more. Yeah, I have a feeling next time there's gonna be real story happening. Not in this episode. Nope. So where the fuck did my bottom bun go? What? I'm eating like a sloppy joe and my bottom bun just disappeared. Um. I thought you said you, your bottom butt, not your bottom <laughs> bun. Yeah, your butt just randomly disappeared, Rob. I, I think you should uh get that looked at. <laughs> Hey, there she is. My ass. What do you want? <laughs> yes. I was trying to do this all episode. We're doing it. You want to spend time with me? No. no. I don't know what you're planning, <laughs> but... <laughs> Just walk away. Do whatever you want. Wait, what was that, Rob? Just say no and walk away. Yeah? <laughs> it's like, I don't know what you're planning. Okay, bye. <laughs> Alright. Come on, Toko. Uh, yeah, there's that there's that porn face. Yeah. Let's give her that book. I got the book waiting for you, Miss Person who's constantly judgmental bitch. Um where is it? Raiden's hang bag. Hang hang hand bag. Hang bag. Hang bag. Uh what's it called? Um what the fuck? <laughs> A wash basin intended to give you the courage to seek out the true man's fantasy, specifically in public bathhouses. Ah, uh, la 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 la. So I'm giving that to Sakura, right? <laughs> <laughs> it's either that or that's or, uh, wrong. <laughs> either that or Fumi. Voice changing bow tie. Voice changing? Yeah. I didn't even see that. Originally belonged to a detective who had the body of a child but the mind of a genius. The bow tie use its speak lets its speaker use a variety of voices. She would love that. It's a detective thing. Oh, that's what it's called. The Secrets of Amaplata. A little known book about Brazilian ju jiu jitsu that teaches the high level shoulder lock techniques. Amaplata is just another world for the scapula or shoulder blade, so soccer no, 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 would probably no, no, not give that to Okay, I'll give it to her. Oh, she liked it. <laughs> what is this? More pity? Do you always give people presents when you pity them? Well, at least the game said that I liked it. <laughs> you really are, are a total sucker. Maybe. She's just standing there. Menacingly! Get out of there, SpongeBob! <laughs> Does she want something? I already gave you a book. Oh, damn it, you made a reference. <laughs> so what's the day? But she's not saying anything. Maybe we should try to start a conversation. Um, 
go. <laughs> what? You want to talk to me? Well, I can't stop you. You still talk already. <laughs> okay, sure, but what should I say? Uh, so, what do you like to do in your spare time? <laughs> Why do you want to know? Can you show me? Well, I, I mean, I know. We're trapped here together, right? If we're gonna be friends, it'd be nice to get to know each other. That's what I said since day one. <laughs> huh? What'd you just say? Oh god, the music stopped. Uh, what? <laughs> After that part about being trapped, we're gonna be what? Now the creepy music started, what? <laughs> <laughs> Toko. What do you mean, friends? You think I'm so stupid? You tried to trick me. I've already been hurt once before. I'm not gonna let it happen again. You've been hurt? What happened? Anyway, come on. You, you don't really care about me. You don't want to know about me, even if I know that. There was no if there. No, no, that's not true. Fine. What the heck? Fine! Then t tell me! Tell you what? Tell you, what? <laughs> you know why they call me the ultimate writing prodigy, right? Yeah, yeah sure. You've sure. won, 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 won all kinds of literature, literature prizes, prizes and stuff. And stuff. <laughs> then tell me what I'm good at. Tell me... What? <laughs> yeah, I mean, you could have stuttered there anyway. It still would have worked. Fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying to do a purposeful stutter for once. Tell me... Uh, I can't. Just do it. <laughs> Tell me what my genre specialty is. Tell me what my gender speciality is. Fuck you, that's not what I was going to say. <laughs> if you really want to convince me you give a crap, you should at least know that. You went romance. Yeah, I remember yeah, this. Romance. Romance. Romance, of course. Oh, you I actually do. Uh, I mean, it was kind of hinted at from in I, the last I episode, I think. <laughs> <laughs> that true. That that, that true. <laughs> your, big, your biggest success was So Lingers the Ocean, right? Everyone says it's your masterpiece. The book was such a hit that fisherman shot to the top of the hottest men poles, right? God damn it! How did you know all that? There's no way you care about me. Uh, it's the other way around, Toko. <laughs> you don't care about me. I'm telling you, I do. I mean, we're friends, aren't we? <laughs> I'm blind! Your straightforward nature blinded me! <laughs> the dialogue in this game is great. And she <laughs> I don't. <laughs> <laughs> While Toko ran away, screaming like a banshee. <laughs> Bruh, I'm not really I'm sure. sure. Does she hate me now? <laughs> I mean, I mean, she, she hated, hated me before, me before but, but does she hate me more now? Oh, hey, I unlocked the skill vocabulary. Give yourself a pat on the back, or have someone else give me a pat on the back that's increasingly getting louder over time. And, okay, now it's just slapping me. You've earned it! <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm sure this is going to sound great. Sounds good on this end. Uh-huh. Once we're all done, I headed back to my room. Okay, now you can stop. Now you can stop patting yourself, Caitlin. This. Okay. 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 Oh my god. <laughs> I'm sorry. Yeah, let's, make, let's make more sex jokes. It's good. It's great. What? What? Eh, don't worry. I'll tell you. I'll tell you later, Rob. Anyway. If you can communicate it to me. <laughs> I guess I'm feeling a little hungry. I oh, better am get I, some. Am I? I better get something to eat before it's night time. Yeah, maybe, yeah, I, maybe should. I should. <laughs> I should head, I should to, head the to the dining hall then, I guess. In the next episode, because it's night time, and we've gone for 40 minutes, with that lovingly great ending, <laughs> next time... <laughs>
<laughs> Next time, there's going to be a wild toko that we're going to catch. And we're going to go to the dining hall and hopefully get some food before we go to bed. See you guys next time. Bye.